When music and TV stars collide, you get one of the best podcasts in the nation. Tina. Former Our Lady Peace drummer Jeremy Taggart and actor comedian Jonathan Torres, you guys join us. We couldn't be happier. Thank you for having us. I have been laughing my Sorry. way. Oh, you're going to keep clapping. You're just going to keep trying to liven it up. You know? Do you ever clap up? on a plane when it lands and try oh, to be yeah. the first person to clap? <laughs> There's a moment when they let off the brakes just a little bit. Yeah. And if you're the first clapper, you can actually make it spread. Try yeah. It's usually on a charter to Cancun. Yeah. It's like the wave. Yeah. Okay. So tell Tell me about this. Tonight you have a show. It is your first comedy and Canadianity tour. Yes. So let's get into all things Canadianity. For okay. example, we just saw this morning Norm Kelly in the Hotline Bling box. Does this mean our politicians are officially becoming cool? I wouldn't say so. I don't know how cool that was. I know we all love Norm <laughs> Kelly. Wow. But uh, he's got some crazy tweets. He likes the tweets. And uh, uh, Canadianity to me is more Kevin Frankish on a daily basis. Okay, so he doesn't know this. You guys just came up with a new nickname for Kevin Frankish, and it is Kmart. You said Zap. the franchise. The franchise, because yeah. he's a franchise in this place. Kev is here on known as Kmart or the franchise. Yeah. Thank it, you so much for giving me that. What better nickname than the franchise? That yeah. says it all. It's very cool. All yeah. of a sudden, he can wear like a franchise cologne and just be yeah. known. It's like I can smell. Wouldn't him. you wear Kev for men? Yeah. He Kev could totally men. do like the um, I would wear Kev for men, and I'm a girl. <laughs> yeah. He could do the existential type. It's commercial. like a. It's like oh, a. He, oh, here's Kevin. He looks perturbed. Smells he, like a cactus in the snow. It looks like he smelled something foul. Kmart. Oh, he's good. I'll not see. That, can't talk. He's, what? Is that not the failed uh, store? I'm, I'm just pointing oh, that out. Oh, no, it's bad. It means the name is up for grabs, Bob. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just pouring syrup over poo. Trying to be a little glass half full around yeah. here. Okay, Kev, they were trying to pay you a compliment. No, nah, they're, mad, they're mad about the podcast comment. I know it. No, I know we're it. not. No, we like Sometimes it. people tease because they love, and we know that's where it's coming from exactly. with you. We'll see, in the, love. we'll see you in the parking lot, Kmart. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the Kmart parking lot. Uh, can we also <laughs> please talk about Drake for a minute? As dads, are you offended by people calling it a dad dance like mom jeans? Or do you embrace the dad dance? Do you dad dance? When I first saw it, I thought oh, it was we like... we dance like that. <laughs> you know in the mall when somebody glues, it's like just for laps gag, somebody glues pieces of change on the ground and you bend down to pick it up and then realize it's stuck and try to play it cool? Yeah. That's what the hotline bling dance looks like to me. Yeah, and I think it's got a, a definite 45-year-old uh, uncle at a wedding that's just, you know, a couple too many Cosmos. So you embrace, you embrace all things dad dance and Drake? Yeah. Yeah, for sure. You got to give it. The only thing is that someone from the East Coast, I can't relate to the technology. If it was like you used to page me on my pager <laughs> or you used to call me on the party line at the cottage, those lyrics would speak to me more because you pick up the phone and someone else is already on there eavesdropping. I also need to ask you about our Prime Minister. Uh, yesterday or the day before, Vogue said he's the most unconventionally beautiful man. So he made the beautiful list. Would you say he's unconventionally handsome? Is unconventional an insult? Yeah. Is it a code word it for totally like is. ugly? It's like you're not really, but. Sounds to me like. Like it is. What do it's you think like of the character. Post? He's in the library. He's feeling the library. He's I think he's trying to bling it up with all the knowledge around him. For one thing, I feel he's like he's looking he pretty fancy. Be, I feel like he needs to be part of your podcast because you have a JT thing It'd happening. It would be a three times JT. We're doing a show in Ottawa. He could come. Is all I'm saying. He just you, got to London. Take one quick bump back. JT come free. on stage. We'll do a few bits. You can hit the post with us. Call, it, just, call JT. it the Tri Podcast. Yeah. Yes. Maybe we can get some kickbacks. I want to join their band. <laughs> See them tonight. Taggart and Torrance will make you laugh. Guarantee. They're at the Mod Club tonight on Twitter. Follow them, Dina. Taggart and Torrens. Taggart and Torrens. Say, please come back often. Good morning, everyone. 100%. Good morning. <laughs> Coming up, Jen's got Door Crasher number three. We we're just talking about game shows. A 16 cubic foot refrigerator. That's when we come back from Leon's. Get it while it's hot or cold. All right.